Hi there and welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you what I bought in a Best Buy and this is a great solution for taking photos of nails because you know it's really important to show your clients your portfolio what you can do and sometimes I see really great nails really great artwork but the pictures look so dark so I found the good solution here if you are a professional photographer or if you have a you know this professional big cameras and you know how to use them well probably it won't be much interesting for you but if you're just like me, if you're using your phone to take pictures and you're looking for new solutions on how to make them better, then I think it will work for you. So let's go! This is the kit I bought in Best Buy, it's called Mobile Photography Kit. I know that you can buy all of this stuff separately, but in this case I found that the kit is actually cheaper. And first thing that it is in there is a tripod. It actually folds so it won't take much place in your purse and then you can open it and this is the holder for the phone which expands so that means you can fit any phone that you want in there oh and by the way it works with Android and iOS both so no matter what kind of smartphone you have it will work anyway so we need to place the phone here and now we can you know, it will just stay there so we can take pictures, take videos, you can move it so you can hold it in this position or you can take photo from upside down. And also I like that this tripod, it's not just, you know, solid, these legs, they are actually, you can move them and that means you can hang, hang it on, on some place, which is really convenient and then you just need to fold it back and just take it with you. Another exciting part about this kit is that it comes in such a nice hard bag, which is I think a best solution if you're traveling. And now let's see what we have here. So first thing and one of the most important is the light. So it looks like this. You need to charge it with USB cord, so you can, you know, put it in your computer in in the cord with USB in any of them. And then we need to put it in a uh, socket for headphones in your phone. And then there is on off. Turn it on, and we have three different modes here, which is high, medium, and low. I'm sorry that I'm actually lighting in your eyes. So let's check how it works. So, okay. Uh, oh, and by the way, once you charge it, it actually works without a phone. So this is works more like a holder. So it's more convenient to hold it, but you can use it even without the phone. So this is the low light. And now let's, oh my God, I can't say anything now. Let's switch to high. See, it lights pretty good. Well, now it's daytime, so it's already pretty light already. But uh, I tried it in a really dark room and it actually lights it a lot. Now, let's try what we actually bought it for. How does it light up the nails? Now, let's put it in the phone. And I will turn to the camera mode and I will turn it around as we need to take a picture of something that's behind and let's try the medium mode and I turn it on and okay this is my hand I have oh my god you see how this hand that you can see through the camera of my phone is so much wider and like lighter than the hand that you can see you know that's back there that's the actual hand so Okay, here's the difference. Yeah, the lightning is pretty good, definitely. And also, you can use it without the phone. You can just take it off. And, okay, now let's try the low mode. And just simply light it up. Well, I, unfortunately, I will have almost to close 
this camera because usually I will light somewhere from here so there no shadows will appear. Well, it looks pretty good. You can see without it. It's different. Well, now it's not as dark, but in the when it's dark, it really works great. And now let's try the high mode. And yes, it lights it up a lot better. So, of course, if you have a professional equipment and good lighting at your home, this is not enough and this will never change it. But if you are traveling, if you want to take pictures somewhere where you just don't have an opportunity to have this good lighting, I think this is one of the best solutions. Or if you are traveling to another country and you have no idea what sockets will be there, you know. So, this will help you a lot. So. A plus from me for this thing. Another thing that we have here is the microphone, which again we need to connect to your phone and then you can record the better quality audios or videos, especially outside or in the rooms where it's crowded or some noise might appear. And well, maybe it's not really what you need if you're not recording videos, but it comes in the kit, so why not? And the most important part that we have is the lenses. So there are three lenses that come in the kit. One is fisheye, which allows you to take photos which has this fisheye effect. And it's kind of fun when you know you want to put some object in the center. And another one is a wide angle. Uh, which is great if you want to take picture of people in the room and fit everybody or some landscapes. And the last one is actually the one we mostly need for the nails, is micro lenses. We will also need this clip, which looks like a regular clip with a hole here, and the lens itself. So they look like this and I recommend you to open it first from here. Do not open both at once because you know there are lenses, we don't want to touch the glass parts. And now we simply need to scroll it here mm -hmm. and now we can open and this is the micro lens. So to use it on your phone, you simply need to put this clip on your camera and now we can take a micro lens photo. So let's check it how it will work on the nails. First, we need to place it right on top of the camera. Make sure it actually fits perfectly so you won't have any dark circles on your phone. Now turn it around and let's try it with this design. Put it closer. Oh my god, I can see every tiny thing on this design. My my hand is even shaking. I'm I'm so excited. Oh my god, that's like a I'm a professional photographer now. Okay, so this is the original tip and this photo that we have. So you see actually you can see every tiny particle of it. Oh my god, I could I didn't even knew it it's so porous. Okay, so I think this is a nice picture of that. Okay, now let's try another one. Let's try this mica shiny stuff. And okay, we'll put three of them. And take it closer. Oh, there's so many bubbles in it. I couldn't uh, even see it with my naked eye. Is there any? You see? You, can, you can't really see it actually. But on this photo, it looks like there are plenty of tiny bubbles in there. Oh, well, it's kind of cool. See? This is the bubble. It's huge. Well, yeah, it's kind of really nice and bright picture. Oh, and by the way, if you want to see the tutorial for this and the previous design I show you, I have it on my channel as well. So, A plus for micro lenses for the nails. One more thing that goes on the kit is the button. So it's a Bluetooth remote which you need to pair with your phone and then you can simply click and it will take a photo of you. So this is really nice when you want to take a picture of you but not do a selfie 
or if you want to take picture picture of your family and there's nobody who can take a picture of you so you can all sit down relax and just push the button and the last thing which is not in the kit I bought it separately but I think I really need it so this is the holder for the phone which expands and on the other side it has this standard socket for regular tripod so you can put it anywhere you like and then you just fold it and it's really small so it actually fits in there as well so this is a really nice bag that we have here you can take it with you wherever you go so I hope you like this idea on how we can make better pictures of our nails please share in the comments if you have more ideas on how do you do your lightning, your photography secrets for your nails? I think it will be really useful, not only for me, but for the other subscribers. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you later. Bye!